any decent country, especially a developing one, seeks to attract foreign investment. Global experience demonstrates that foreign capital inflows are beneficial to the economy. They prompt modernization of production infrastructure, technology transfer, management upgrade, marketing and overall integration into global economic processes. Kazakhstan attracted more than $300 billion of foreign direct investment in the pre-pandemic period. This number put us ahead of the rest of the region regarding the quantity of foreign capital in the economy. Naturally, this achievement did not just happen overnight. Investments are made only under favorable conditions which Kazakhstan has consistently and relentlessly worked to create. Perhaps the most attractive factor for investors is the work of Astana International Financial Center Court and Arbitration Center. The AIFC Court works within the framework of English law, which is comprehensible and well-known to foreign business. Well, there are many uh, unique factors, if you like, that make this court and also the arbitration centre. Um, we must remember we're a court and an arbitration centre independent um, as really attractive to investors. Number one, both the court and arbitration centre are truly unique for the whole of the Eurasia region. There's nothing else like this anywhere else. There are lots of arbitration centres, there are lots of courts, but nothing at this top international standard applying common law procedure at the court with international foreign judges who have decades of years of experience and reputation and trust from international investors all over the world. So the project is special just because it's so unique and it provides a truly world-class international standard of justice. Anybody can settle their disputes at the International Arbitration Centre or AIFC Court at any time, even in an online format. Most importantly, this dispute must be of an economic nature and both parties must consent to resolve it only in the AIFC court or arbitration centre. By the way, there are no regionally unique cases among more than 2,000 cases already handled in this court. Regardless of where in the world they occur, business disputes are all the same. The only thing that matters most is that they are processed in a fair and impartial manner. We believe this court and arbitration centre really do now deliver top international standard justice, but not just that. The work they're actually doing with the cases is reflective of the highest international courts and arbitration centres in other parts of the world. And that is to the credit of Kazakhstan. It is another reason why investors, I think, are now telling us and other people that they are genuinely considering investing in Kazakhstan just because this court and arbitration centre are here delivering justice that they believe they can trust. AIFC Court and International Arbitration Centre has been in operation since 2018. Over the years, it has issued about 100 court decisions and 500 arbitration awards and nearly 2,000 mediation agreements. That is a pretty full work schedule and there will likely be more to come. We're actually going to contribute significant value to the development of arbitration and international dispute resolution practices in Kazakhstan and for the whole of Eurasia, but we're going to do it here in Astana. And the reason we're doing that as a part of our improving every year reputation with all the international investors is that we want the world to see Astana is here on the map as a central place for international investors to come and invest through the AFC and in Kazakhstan, but also if they have a problem, as all business people have, for whatever reasons, good or bad, they have problems in their contracts, they have problems in investments, you can and you should and you must come to the AFC court and International Arbitration Center whenever you have a problem. You can trust us, people are trusting us, and we expect that to continue. The AIFC court has already expanded the scope of its work beyond Astana and even Kazakhstan. Regional offices are currently operating in several other Eurasian countries. Moreover, this contributes to the growing trust that foreign and domestic investors have in Kazakhstan as a nation with a successful and independent economic judiciary.